And you know this guy, Charles, from not Trio Smart Cal anymore. Trio Test and Measurement. Trio Test and Measurement. And we're, he's got something new. Yeah, we're in the test and measurement business, you and that's the what the company's called. And you've just released this thing. Yeah, so this is... Tell this, us about it. This is called the Wens 540, and it's... And uh, who are Wens? Uh, Wens are a Korean company that OEM for a lot of major manufacturers. Who shall, rema so remain, shall name remain nameless. Nameless, yep. yep. And, and it's uh, called a debug meter. This is called a debug meter. And if you look at the box, you'll see there's actually a range of debug meters. Oh, okay. Yeah, the, one, right. the one we're looking at is the 540, is the 540 the which is more on the electronics and communication side of debugging. Right. Yep. Whereas we do have an electrical version as well, which has got, um, got milli it. milliometer LED yep. tester, all that sort of thing in it. But they call it a debug meter, but really it's a, in a multimeter. It's a multimeter graphene oscilloscope, uh, yeah. logic probe, uh, yeah. serial protocol it's, it's actually, decoder. Yeah, it's quite a it's yeah. sensitive little oscilloscope. There's a lot of noise around in here with everything yep. we got going in the lights, so it's picking that up. So, but it's an oscilloscope. Yep. Uh, it's 10 megahertz oscilloscope. 10, 10 meg bandwidth via the usual banana jacks. It doesn't by, by have banana, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just normal yep. bananas. Uh, then it's got a voltmeter. Yep. And you'll see that it's also got DBM, and you can change the reference impedance. Yes, of course. And you can do relative, min, max, etc. Um, you can go have a look at use it as an ohm meter. Yep, so that goes up, ohms. went up to yep. at least 50 meg. Yeah. And then you can obviously continuity. Yep. How fast is the continuity tester? Nice little tester. graphic. Never tested it. No, don't, no, don't, tested don't know. It. It's, okay, it's brand it's new. It's too new. It's too new. Then we got diode test. Yep. And, and capacitance, and capacitance as well. all the normal yep. things you'd expect. Ah, uh, one picofarad resolution, very mm -hmm. nice. Yep. Yep. And we've got uh, yep. ammeter, and it's actually yep. got resolution down to 10 nanoamps. How many counts is the meter? Uh, in it's 50,000 counts. Right, 50,000, 50, yep. Count. Off the top of my head, don't quote yep. me, well, you will on this yep. thing. Ah, anyway. well, yeah, yeah right. anyway, let's say 50,000. Yeah, I think it's 50,000. It's then got a eight channel logic analyzer. It's with, with that plugs well, it's in a the timing. side here. It's a timing analyzer, yeah, yeah there's a yeah. yep. socket here, and there's. And it um, comes with all the probes. It and comes with the probes, which we've got yep. here. So this just, uh, this, pl this plugs in the side. Yep. And it's obviously keyed, as you can see, it's keyed. It's keyed, yeah. And, and, and we got all the connectors on the other end. Yep. Logical place to put them. They're, they're quite good looking probes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they're quite nice. Yeah, yeah. you got a couple of grams. And what's there the as well. uh, sample rate of the logic analyzer? Um, you know? I don't know. I haven't read the spec. Right. Yeah. And sample memory. I'll, yeah. I'll, have to, okay. I'll read it. And have it's a look. two brand new folks. I wonder if it tells you on here. No. Uh, well, take ten thousand data points. Right. It's got a ten k sample memory. That's adequate uh, for. A... That's what it looks like. Logic yeah. analyzer. Logic. Analyzer. Yeah. I'll have, I'll have to read the right. spec. As I say, Man. it's just brand new. We've only just got it. Um, so anyway, so that's the logic analyzer, and you can set up trigger conditions, etc., uh, which channel you want to trigger off, yep. all that sort of stuff. Then it's got a protocol, and this is when it gets interesting, protocol analyzer. Yes, so what protocols have we got? We've we got, got Lin. Canvas, Linbus, I2C, uh, UART, Serial, or UART. Uh, USB. That's USB 2? US, USB, high-speed, and uh, full-speed. Right, yep. No, no, sorry. Uh, the, the two slowest ones. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. that one, yeah. Yep. And uh, SM bus, oh, yep. I, I2S, sorry. I2S I, I, I audio, yeah. Yep. Uh, SPI. SPI, of course. Um, DMX 512 for lighting yep. and Dallas One Wire. There you go. Very nice. Yeah. And yep. uh, again, you can set up your trigger conditions as to where you, which channel you want to trigger off, etc. Then you can go to a pattern generator. And so we're set up to generate a pattern, um, set, set up the serial, uh, 8 bit, no parity, two stop bits. Yep. You can say, uh, what's the interval between packets? So you repeat it 100 times. Uh -huh. You can then set set the data in there as to what you want to send. So you can set Very your condition. Very handy. Yeah, and there's your, there's your board rates. There's your board. It goes up to 921. Uh, 921.6, yeah. Yep. There you go. Yeah, so there's your board rates. Oh, and excellent. so you, if you want to squirt a bit of data down and see if it's coming out the other end, yep. you can do that. And finally, there's a nice little square wave. Uh, oh, you can you adjust can, the duty cycle. And you can and all adjust that sort the duty stuff? cycle and, and adjust the frequency. And what frequency does that go to? Uh, I don't know. It goes, up to, it goes up to a meg. A, a meg, okay. And you can then bring it down. And yep. it's obviously in weirdo harmonics of whatever oh, its own okay. internal clock is. Right. And you can change the duty cycle. It's, it's actually quite intuitive because I've never tried this before, but you can see okay. it just move that. Yeah, that is quite neat. There's my yeah. duty cycle look. And, uh, Very nice. I don't know if you can turn the beeper off. I think <laughs> I might yeah, do that under certain conditions. Yeah. yeah. Right. And that's it. And they're $795 nice. X stock. 795 Australian. Australian. For yeah. this. Not bad. Right. No, that's pretty good. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much, You're welcome. Charles.